The month of July seems to be the month of RAG. We recently covered graph RAG from Microsoft and I also did a couple of videos on various techniques of RAG and now we have rank rag which has been released by nvidia in the form of a paper by the way and i'll be upfront unfortunately there is no code there is no framework at the moment there is no model so i won't be able to show you any hands-on i have checked nvidia's website i have checked hugging face but i couldn't find any but i'm more than sure this will be released soon and then we will do a hands-on demo but for the purpose of this video let's try to understand why this rank rag is so cool and i believe that this is going to be a big thing very soon before that let's try to understand two terminologies which are fulcrum of this whole project first is rag rag or retrieval augmented generation is a way to improve language models like chatbots or any other models to be fine-tuned or to get more context around your own data when you do the RAG, it helps those models to answer questions or generate text more accurately by retrieving relevant information, reading and understanding the retrieved information, and then generating an answer or text based on that information. So then we have another term, which is a hyperparameter called as top underscore K. It is a hyperparameter used in various models, including RAG pipelines, and ranking models. It refers to the number of top ranked items such as context passages and in context of rag top underscore k determines the number of contexts retrieved by the retrieval module that are passed to the language model for answer generation. For example if top underscore k is equal to 5 the retriever model selects the top 5 most relevant context which are then used by the language model to generate an answer and that is directly proportional to the context length of the model context length means that the amount of data a model keeps in perspective at one time to generate the next token okay so now we know what top k is and what rag is now let's see what is a ranker model or a ranking model when we say a ranking model it is a model which is used to process nlp and this ranker model works on the information retrieved by the retrieval model. A ranker model typically takes it in a query and a set of candidate items as input. It then assigns a score or rank to each item based on how well it matches the query or how relevant it is to the task at hand. The goal or objective of a ranker model is to place the most relevant or accurate items at the top of the ranking so that the user can quickly find the best answer or information. So you need to know these three terms like rag, top underscore k and ranker model for this research to be understood. So NVIDIA has introduced this rank rag 8 billion and 70 billion dual purpose re-ranker generation model that outperforms GPT-4 across nine RAG benchmarks and that is why this is such an exciting project. Traditional RAG methods retrieve the top K context from a database or a vector store in order to generate answer using an LLM but face challenges and issues when too many contexts exceed the generation context window or poor recall when K or top underscore K is equal to too small. The rag rag framework overcomes these issues by instruction tuning a single LLM for both context re-ranking and answer generation, which enhances its ability to identify relevant context from a larger retrieved K and it delivers high quality answer as written. If you go through the paper and look at the overall uh, strategy of the method, it performs instruction tuning using multiple data sets, then it merges originally uh, original instruction data with QA data and then it fine-tunes the model again on these combined specialized data set and then it evaluates on open QA. So rank rag has already shown notable performance gain over chat QA 1.5 particularly on challenging benchmarks due to initial retrieval difficulty. Also it has exceeded the performance of specialized re-ranking models trained on larger data set and we have covered re-ranking models a lot on the channel so all in all seems really good but unfortunately again i am a bit disappointed that nvidia didn't release the 
code or weights but as soon as they are out i'm going to make another video and show you a hands-on uh, demo but until then remember that rank rag is another rag technique which is there there are two models in the offering too so let's wait for them to be released i hope that you enjoyed it let me know what do you think if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching